Okay, let's make today white chicken stock. It is a base for a lot of soups and a lot of sauces, so it's important to know how to make one correct. Today my stock will be based on Paul Bocuse recipe, but instead of chicken wings, I will use chicken carcasses, chicken bones and chicken skins. So let's see what we need to make one and let's start cooking. One leek, one celery stick, two cloves, two carrots, two onions, three bay leaves, few sprigs of thyme and parsley. Let's start cooking. Okay, so we start by peeling the onions and carrots. Wash the rest of the vegetables and cut them into smaller pieces. This will help to cook them faster and more evenly. We crush the garlic and then start making the stock. Put the chicken in the pot and pour cold water over it so that it covers the whole thing. Heat to boil and then scoop the scum from the top of the water. It should take something around 3 minutes. This will help us to obtain a clear stock. Put the chopped vegetables in the pot and reduce to low heat. We want stock to simmer very gently. Be careful not to boil it. In this case liquid will emulsify with fat rendered from chicken and that will make your stock cloudy. After 3 hours your stock should look something like that. At this point there is nothing else to do but strain the broth. You can wait for it to cool down and put it in the fridge. It should last in the fridge 3-4 days. That's why I like to pasteurize my stock. I pour hot liquid into the sterilized glass jars. I close them tightly and then turn around and wait to cool down. Then I transfer stock to the fridge. It should last there for something around one month. That's everything for today. Thank you for watching and have a wonderful day.